hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to change buckets here in microsoft planner so let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time here in microsoft planner i want you to click the sign up option and from here just to follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Changing buckets in Microsoft Planner is a straightforward process and allows you to organize tasks effectively as your project evolves. Once you are logged into your account, I want you to hover to the left side panel of your dashboard and go to the plans that you wanted to change the buckets. If you haven't already, just you have the option to create a new plan on the upper right corner. Click on the plus button. You can start from any of these templates. Simple plan, project management, software development, business plans, and employer boarding. For example, you decided to choose the software development. You click on it, and of course, you use this template right here. It includes list, board, chart, and schedule views. You click that. You rename this as this one, and you click on the create. So wait for it while everything has, is being set up for you. All right now, you see, right now, you feel like the buckets are not um, arranged according to your preferences. For you to be able to change these buckets, you have multiple options. Number one is obviously you can rename that. You just have to click on the arrow. You can click on the three dots icon here to rename or simply click on the rename here. For example, this one here. All right. You can do that. You could also do this here. And of course, you can rename this as well. So you have a lot of options. After doing so, you can also change the buckets by simply right-click on this. You have you can delete unnecessary buckets that you wanted. If you feel like it's redundant and it's it, 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 it creates clutter on your workspace, you see that? Now we have a more, it's a clean and organized kind of a, a board here, all right? You can add a new bucket if you want, but for now, let's delete some of them. You are actually on the board view. If you click on the grid, you'd be able to see that your buckets are perfectly in place. All right. And obviously, after the bucket, you can change the progress from these. Sort ascending. You can choose from in progress, completed. And of course, you can choose uh, different kinds of labels. You can choose from different colors. From this. Now, this becomes like a lavender. This becomes like, uh, like a green. So on and so forth. So you have a lot of options here in changing buckets in Microsoft Planner. And that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next one.